girl. This is tea. Wait, cause these is tea. These are so tea. This is tea. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to the channel if you are new. My name is Shatara, you're gonna love it here so make sure you go ahead and subscribe. We are about to get into this weekend vlog and I'm really excited for this one because your girl's actually going outside. If you know me, you know I'm a homebody and I don't be going nowhere. But we have festivities to attend so let's get into it so today is friday april the 12th i just wrapped up with work now we are about to head out to best buy i set up an appointment with our geek squad to see if they could fix my camera my appointment is in 20 minutes so let's head out no competition yeah glow that's my part she be like curbing on curbing Y'all basically just wasted time going to Best Buy because they were not able to fix my camera. I did everything correct. I called in advance. I was like, first off, will y'all help me out even though I didn't purchase my camera from y'all? They was like, yes. Boom. I'm like, okay, bet. That means I don't need to have a warranty or anything. She's like, no. I'm like, okay, because this was purchased on Amazon. She's like, don't worry about it. Come on in. Girl, straight lies to my ear. I won't, I won't say face because he's on the phone. She straight out lied to my ear, girl. So, boom, that was the only reason why I booked an appointment with the Geek Squad. I go in. He's like, yeah, for this damage, we send cameras out if you have a warranty. I say if I have a warranty. That's not what the girl said on the phone. He was like, if you have a warranty. Like, I don't know why she said that. But I'm like, oh, my Lanta. And that was like the worst case scenario for me was one, they was going to like, quote me a crazy price um because i spent almost 900 dollars on this camera this ain't <laughs> this ain't the number twos like this bitch go way back these bitches go way back and these ain't the number twos so i'm like for one please don't quote me a crazy price and for two don't have to hold my camera overnight or anything like that because i plan on vlogging every single day so yeah couldn't do couldn't get done what i needed to get done like, it's something so small but it matters to me because why is this even happening i'm about to show y'all what it look like where my where my um camera's battery and the sd card is it's just wide open my girl's goodies is all out and that's not okay so we're just gonna have to try to get her fixed another day however this wasn't a complete waste of my time because i am very close to my next destination which was gonna be alta so i mentioned did i mention this i don't think so i mentioned i was gonna be outside but i didn't say what i was doing <laughs> this tomorrow i'm gonna be celebrating one of my friends birthdays so i'm going to go get her a cute little gift also going to pick up some things for myself because i can't go into ulta or sephora and shop for anyone else where i'll get myself something it's just something that's wrong with me girl i love spending money so let's head there oh the sun is coming out see jeez see god is telling me that there's a brighter day okay there's always gonna be a brighter day let the church say amen Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so. We're back home, guys. I definitely ended up being me some oxtails. <laughs> so before I dig into my food, we need to do a quick haul. I was just blasting it. Alright, so boom. First things first, I ordered me a microphone, you guys. Ah, so I can like click it onto myself when I'm out and about. So if I'm on a hot girl walk like I was in my previous video and the wind is blowing, you'll still be able to hear me over the wind. If I'm in a crowded area and there's music playing in the background, you'll hear me over the music and the talking. Da -da -da. So guys. Um, let us pray that these work really, really well because I'm trying to up my quality for my lifestyle vlogs. <laughs> then I got me a fan, girl, a little portable fan because the will be hot when she go outside. And I know my friend is having a house party tomorrow, but I don't know if we're doing anything after that. 
and next weekend i'm gonna be outside outside like girl outside and i'll be hot and i hate having a sweaty makeup face like that's actually disgusting i was like let me be like the girlies i see out in the clubs and get me a little portable fan i'm gonna put everything that i got on my amazon storefront and then y'all will be able to shop the different links i wonder if it's already charged but i want to try it it got a one percent it's also a flashlight that'll come in handy i think it's dead so it's not turning on but hopefully she worked well because i remember one time i was out in a club and i splitted my whole face off like i wanted to cry I think I probably did shed a few tears, honestly speaking. I was not having it. And then I got some glasses. I found these off another girl's Amazon storefront. So hopefully they're cute. Hopefully they fit my face well because my face is kind of small. Um, and if you have any tips on how to preserve your makeup while you're wearing glasses, put it in the comments because I still have yet. So, ah! Wait, because these is tea. They're orange. They make everything around me look orange, too. But these is tea. Hold on now. Hold on. Because these fit my cute little face. <sighs> they real chunky on the side. These, this is cute. Hold on. Let me look at myself. Girl, these is tea. My mother would like these. That's one thing my mama love is some sunglasses. These is tea. Okay, and I think they would look really good with these shoes that I just got. Let me show you. I got me some Sambas, y'all. I keep I kept saying all the girls as well. But I want it to be different. So I got a black pair. I don't have any black shoes. Like, none. The darkest shoe I have is brown. It's some Yeezys that I've had for years now. But, um, this is tea. Get them tall. This is T. I got the platform. I wanted something different. So I went platform and I went black. And I think these are so cute. Um, the, the stripes on the side look white. But under some lights they also look iridescent. I don't know if y'all can tell on camera. But I love these down. I got a six and a half. If you're curious as to like how the sizing works. Everyone says size down. Because these can look like boats. And they run big on your feet. Like the overall fit is just really big. So I technically I do wear six and a half, but I like to say I'm a seven nowadays because I be wanting rum and I like wearing thick socks. So I just say I'm a seven. Plus seven is my favorite number. <laughs> so I just be like, I'm a seven. And um I made sure not to get a seven in that shit because people say they're big. But so far it looks like all my purchases are spot on love that for me everything got here really quickly too so i love that um something i'm about to order again <laughs> off amazon is a mobile tripod for my camera because i just recently bought a new tripod for my camera for staying in the house she's huge i can't take her out and about um and next week i'm going to my school isn't it called olamada or something olamada call them all of all of something like that girl I'm going to my old university and um, I need to have a little cute tripod for my camera that I could take out and about with me. And it's not super big bulky like this. That is my little haul. Um, if you want to see everything I got from Ulta, I showed y'all the lip glosses and then I got this mascara because it has a very tiny inner corner and I ran out of mascara anyways. So I needed to re-up and then I'm trying out this Kendra blow dry spray because I'm gonna start wearing my hair stretched more I think question mark don't 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 quote me but I think I am and then my girly pops gift card so yep those are all my treats and trinkets I mean, my oxtail platter. She's hefty. I asked for them to give me more cabbage than rice. Cause they be piling on the rice, baby. I'm not gonna eat all of that rice. I don't need all them carbs. And they cabbage sucks. I ain't gonna cop to you if you go there. The cabbage is not good. I was told that the greens are good, but I don't believe that. I don't know. My friend Peter told me that the, the greens is good, but I have yet to try it. 
So I can't vouch for their greens yet. But their cabbage be a little hot. But I think that's how Jamaicans make their cabbage. I don't know. Mm-hmm. That oxtail is tender though. That's all I care about. I have self-control too because I wanted a beef patty, but I didn't get one. Oh no cocoa bread. But anyways, I'm about to eat my food and enjoy my show. I have to put y'all on. If you want a really good show, you have a prime video account. Watch Mr. and Mrs. Smith. No, it's not the old movie with what's his name? Brad and Angelina Jolie? No, not them, girl. Danny Glover is acting in the movie, and I think he is a director or producer on the show. It's so good. Um, they replaced the white actors from the movie with people of color. It's so tea. Like, just imagine learning about someone's romantic love life and their wealth assassins. Like, it's, it's crazy. They be doing some insane stuff. So I'm gonna go watch that to eat my food, and I'm gonna call y'all back later, girl. Hello, girly pops. It is the next day. Oh, these are really orange. Okay, I was like, wait, the lighting is not doing me justice right now, but it's the shades. It's, it's definitely the shades. Girl, I look crazy. I don't got a look of makeup on. I got on a pimple patch. So that's kind of my, like, little thing I be doing. If I look crazy in the face, girl, put on some shades. No one will ever know. And it kind of go with the thing. I was a clearly geeked away these because y'all know I just got them in the mail. But it is Saturday, April the 13th. I'm trying to give y'all a quick little fit check before I leave out the house. Don't mind the way my crib looks right now. I got a lot going on. But mind your business. Let me drop y'all down. So I look like a cute little boy today. I have on, um, underneath it's just a black long sleeve. And I have on this varsity jacket. It's my man's. Shout out to him for allowing me to lay in his closet today i think this is from human society i looked at the neck just now i don't know what that is but apparently that's what it is i got on some gray cargo pants and my travis scott sneakers and just some silver accessories shout out to my grammy for giving me the gucci t now I hate the purse that I'm wearing because it don't go with the vibes, but I need a bag because I need a crossbody because when I'm shopping, I like to have my hands free. This is like the worst outfit to shop in, honestly, because I got on a jacket that I'm going to have to put on it off. I got on a bodysuit, OMG, and these cargos look loose, but they're not. They're actually kind of fitted. <sighs> but anyways... Let's run over today's agenda. So first things first, I'm going to Pentagon right now, okay? I have a bag on hold at Coach. Ah! I've been wanting this bag for like forever, ever since it came out, girl, which is I don't know when, but I've been wanting this bag. So I'm going to go get my bag. But we got to go to Zara. I'm probably going to stop by Steve Madden, see what they got. Probably going to stop by Nordstrom, see if they got anything. Um, because I just don't know exactly what vibe I'm going for, so just trying to see what wants me. Okay, and then I want some pajamas. I might stop in Victoria's Secret. I doubt it. And Pentagon now has an Akira, so curious to see if they have like anything of that appeals to me. But we shall see. After Pentagon, um, I'm probably gonna go to Harris Cedar. I need to pick up some wine, and I need to pick up. A card and I like to go through my cards and read them for my my birthday curly then I'm gonna come back get ready I don't know what I'm wearing tonight but tonight is the birthday party so then I gotta truck it to my best friend's house meet her and my sister so we can pregame baby mind you I don't drink no more I just can't do it like college me is half disappointed half at half inspired because like why can't you hold any liquor anymore like that's crazy i'm a complete lightweight now but the other half is like wow you're so healthy that whenever your body consumes that toxicness it knows that that shouldn't be happening so whatevs i will not be taking shots tonight i will not be drinking tequila let us pray that that actually happens and i'm only sipping wine okay because anything else just doesn't make me feel good um, so after the pregame is the party and then we'll see where the night takes us. So 
Let's head out. Let's see. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight items to try on. So, oh, this side is ugly. So, let's start trying this stuff on. So, first we have this basic gray tee, but she's kind of cute because there's like some detailing right here and she's like very long i could dress this up or dress this down this is cute i got it in a medium and this is my ten dollars so that's good i'll wear a different bra though because i got spillage in this bra but this is a win so we're starting off it's very strong okay and then we have this graphic tee I don't know what it says, but y'all can read. Um, it's real plain on the front. I got it in a medium, but it's oversized. I love oversized stuff. I swear I'm a little boy. In the back, it has like crazy detailing. Messing with me, I'll probably wear this backwards. Let me see if I like that. Yeah, I'm gonna wear it like this. Um, this is the back of it. It's basically just artwork. This is a medium and this is $27. I feel like the prices, today are hitting because usually they'll sell this for like $45 because I feel like it's a collection but I just feel like I'm wearing art right now this is cute this is another one y'all so far this might be my favorite it's just a very basic tee but the quality is so nice and then the shoulders and the neck is like an open seam oh. it's a bodysuit though I hate bodysuits I want to get a large this is a medium and it's $27.90 but I just feel like I'm bullied right now. Y'all know I'm on my girly time. But this is cute. I love this. This is another one. We uh three and three right now. Zara is eating. My man is also on Zara right now. And he said that his Zara is eating too. Yeah. And my man picked me up some jewelry and a graphic tee from, from a shop in Philly. How you got your man shopping and you shopping at the same time? Okay, so this completely doesn't fit. I got a medium. I need a large or extra large girl. I couldn't even button, not one button. And then this top is a only only sold in a large or a small. This is a large and it just doesn't fit like my shoulder slash like neckline right. So I don't like it. It's probably because it's too big. So this is too big. That's too small. So both of these are dudes which i'm okay with because i really didn't like this that much and neither did i like this that much like this not really my style i was trying to be out of my comfort zone and i don't think i saw a wash that would like match this so i'm okay with not purchasing these okay so this is the dress and i'm obsessed i like the cut of the sleeve that's cute and then don't mind my bra but i didn't know there was a slit in the front too that you can kind of see and then the entire back is open again don't mind my bra this is sexy i need to get back in that gym and get rid of that little fat roll right there but i think this is cute and i could dress this up some heels silver jewelry bow earring statement like yeah I like this. This is a medium and it's only $35. This is a winner. Oh my god, was I zooming in? My bad. <laughs> my bad. Girl, I can't put these at all. These are six. Oh, it gotta be the cut though. Because they're really, really, really tight on my bum. So, these are the hell no but i'm gonna go back out there and see if i find any in another size because i really want these this is a six and they're fifty dollars which is their usual price for their jeans so i ain't even tripping but i want these these with some heels would be so tea i love the wash i look fit <laughs> or is that the lulu all right, I have one more pair to try on. And then we gonna be outing. And here's a key. Here's here's a little tip when you shopping at Zara. Everybody thinks, oh, um, when the line is long and the women's go to the men's. No, baby, go to the kids. Yeah, they're not gonna turn you away. They're gonna ring you up and it's never nobody over there. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, these are super stretchy, so I know I knew that they were gonna fit me. They look so good on the bum. 
can y'all see they look so good on the bum but they're like super long i'm on my tippy toe right now like they're so long i'm on my tippy toe if i stand flat this is how long they are but i don't want to get them hemmed why do i actually like the big cuff that's crazy i usually hate big cuffs like that but why are they this big why are they so long they're so stretchy and so comfortable though i'm gonna get them because do you see the material i look big i'm just a midget i'm gonna head out mommy see y'all in coach These are cute. And what's the prices of these? 125. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Jeez. Okay, this is 395, right? Mm-hmm. 20 inch. And this is 20 26. And then I was like, I'm gonna 550. 550, okay. Hmm. We like that. It's magnetic on the back. Silver detailing. Can't wear you if I have on gold though, because I don't like the mismatch, but this size doesn't come in that colorway. And there's no, I feel like things are gonna fall out back here, because there's no magnetic. I'm like, you have to only put big items in the back. Like, yeah. Lighter colors, they do get a bit dirty a bit quickly, but we do sell also a leather cleaner. So I'm like, if you have a stain on it directly, like if, if you catch it the day of and you just fuck it out with the cleaner, it comes right up. But if you wait, it might If you stain. wait, yeah, it might, okay. <laughs> might stain it. I think that'll be a cute combo. Hmm, decisions, decisions. No, I'm like, yeah, the gray blue, I like the gray blue because it's a good neutral. It depends on like what it's with. It pulls more blue or it pulls more gray. Yeah. Okay, I think I'm gonna go with this colorway. I wanted a black one, but I need to see. I need a color so I can see in my bag. So it can like, and Art. see, yeah, that, that, <laughs> that gold. gold. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we're back home. I had to go straight home after the mall, girl. I was tired, I was worn out, and I had a massive headache because I didn't eat anything throughout the day. Also, didn't have any fluids. Like, <sighs> me trying to be in a caloric deficit, I'm either, like, doing really well or I'm starving myself. So I need to get better with that. But anyways, this is how I look. I just got out of the shower. It is a couple hours later. So I know I look crazy in my business. I'm not being mean either. <laughs> At this point, I kind of talk to the camera like y'all are my friends because y'all are my virtual friends, my girly pops. So I want to do a quick haul of everything that I got at the mall because I ended up stopping at some different stores and I didn't record everything because your girl was tired. So first things first, let's go over what we got from Steve Madden. Technically, I only got one item to wear, but I did end up getting some supporting items. <laughs> just to make sure i can walk in these heels with no problem but yes i got these girl these is tea do you see the detailing these are so cute i was skeptical because i'm like okay my foot is very narrow um it's nine times out of ten gonna slide because there's no support around the ankle but these are just so cute that i couldn't pass them up so i'm going to put in these little soulmates that i got on the inside okay this cheetah print is dry ugly i wish it was just a straight black but anyways and i'm gonna put these soles on the bottom so they have some grip because this baby i was sliding in the stove so i know i'm gonna be sliding elsewhere and these feel like actually very textured so like you hear that yeah so I got the last size seven. I tried on the seven and a half because my foot is like perfectly right here. I really think I'm a seven at this point. Like I am no longer a six and a half. Your girl is a seven. My feet um, must still be growing and that's perfectly fine. Apparently your feet grow every time you have a child. I don't have time for that. I'm not tall enough, but um, yeah, got these. These were so cute. I'm blanking on the price because they emailed me my receipt instead of printing it. Oh wait, I lied. The receipt is right here. These were every da, da, da. the shoes were 119, but my total ended up being 140 because I got 
the um other stuff those are gonna go with the cute all black dress with the back out yes so speaking of that outfit i got some um accessories from aldo now they had a sale i think it was either about to get one free or it was something with threes of jewelry so yeah i ended up getting all silver accessories so the all black dress yeah girl i'm gonna pair them with these like really pretty statement earrings these are so cute um it's like a spiral detailing these are so tea i feel like they would just eat with a very simple dress with the sparkly heel and my black coach bag. Yeah, I just feel like the black on black with the silver details is just gonna like pop, pop, pop. They also had these like, these, I won't say that these are Bottega dupes. Bottega de nada. I wouldn't say they are because they're like cut open. But it's like a fat teardrop with a little spiral detailing. And these I just thought were super cute. I don't know when or where I'm gonna wear them to. But yes, yes, yes. And then they had rings in small finger sizes. So love that for me. Um, because I have very bony fingers. These are so freaking cute. I'm going to wear these tonight. So I'm keeping these out actually. So I feel like that was a steal. I ended up only spending $36.57 at their store. So yeah. Y'all saw everything for the most part that I got from Zara except for this skirt. Because I saw this when I had came out of the um the dressing room. I wanted to get the gray pants that I showed y'all in a bigger size. But they didn't have an 8. They didn't have a 10. They only had like 12 and 14. So I'm going to have to get those another day. I might go back to the mall because I think I want to exchange something. But we'll see. But instead of getting gray pants, I was like, okay, I can get a gray skirt. And I saw this skirt. This is so T. It's really long. It goes all the way down, but it's open. So I feel like, you know, you can still see some leg. You can still see some shape. It's kind of like not a stretchy material. It don't really have no give. But I feel like the pocket detailing is going to make my... You know how some skirts make your butt look flat or... It accentuates your curves. I feel like a skirt like this will accentuate your curves. And I know for sure I could fit it. I didn't try on in the store in the like actual dressing room, but I like put it around my waist. And it went around my waist, girl. So let us pray. This is a medium. And this was $45.90. So this needs to fit. Cause yeah, I think I'm gonna pair this with my sambas. And some shades and, and the white graphic tee with some jewelry. Some silver. Oh, I could wear those teardrop earrings with that outfit. That'd be cute. That would be really cute. Okay, I'll that. Yeah. And then did I show y'all what bag I ended up getting from Coach? No, I wanna do an unboxing. Well, I got the black on black um 20 inch bag, and then I got a freaking blue wallet. Which I think I want to return, I mean, not return, exchange for the cream because I right now have a blue, a blue card holder. And knowing me, I'm not going to touch the blue card holder anymore now that I have the blue wallet. But it's like, why would you get blue on blue? But why wouldn't you get something different in another color so you can have some variety, you know? No, I'm starting to realize I got too much stuff this color. I have this bag in this color. I have this duffel in that color. And this is my current card holder. Like, nah, this is too much. I don't know, that actually just pissed me off a little bit. <laughs> Cause why didn't I put two and two together when I was in the store and I literally had my card holder out to purchase the items. I did not put two and two together. I think it's just something about that cool tone that I like. And I like the color in general. Like when I see cards that are that color, I'd be like, ugh. My jaw drops. But yeah, y'all, that's everything that I got. Yeah, I guess we should start getting ready, shouldn't we? Because sometimes I be taking a long time. Yeah, girl, come on. Let's just go get ready. Sister. Yes, ma'am. Girl, I should have known your ass was not no way to get ready. <laughs> I should have known. Friend. I'm close, okay? Okay, that's fine then, because... I feel like once I get ready and do all my finishing touches and stuff, we'll probably leave out around the same time. Oh, she... I don't like this color. That's why I got three. 
Okay, you guys, I wasn't able to talk to y'all anymore because I had got on the phone with my sister, but your girl is ready. This clearly is the scent of the night. I'm about to head out. Me, my sister, and my best friend still got to get something to put my card in. So, yeah. I wanted to pick up wine. My best friend got tequila. I don't want to drink, y'all, but we're going to see what it might take us, okay? So come along. Come with me. Cause she can't have a straight face uh, and then when i go in because i ain't got no idea i'm gonna be like look i just got robbed a block away i ain't got no keys I got my no friend purse. don't got her ID, i ain't got shit i got all my phone and god with me right now i just need to get in and try to have a good night please don't ruin it for me I'm about to unbutton this oh no unbutton I just got home this morning. Getting home the next day for Jeter is unheard of. I know y'all heard me say I'm not drinking. I'm only sipping on wine. Apparently too much wine can give you a, a hangover. And I also slipped in a margarita last night. I don't know how. I didn't even want one. I have to abide by my own boundaries and that's something that I'm learning as an adult and it's not easy it's not easy it's not easy but this right here is the most refreshing thing ever if you got a hangover if you are feeling just down and out and grimy and ugh, you need to feel like you need to recover and reset make you make you this tropical smoothie okay this is my favorite it's my go-to it's um frozen bananas they have to be frozen because they get sweeter as you freeze them mangoes lots of mangoes um a little bit of yogurt for creaminess almond milk um honey and ice because that helps out the texture it's so good you can do a splash of like orange juice too but to eat your own and if you don't like milk you can just substitute for the for the orange juice completely it's so freaking good but i just needed to to make me feel alive okay because girl how you didn't make it home last night we had fun though we had a time i didn't film anything and that's how you know a time was had i didn't take not one picture didn't get not one video that's how you know we went we went to this place called alice if you know about Alice in D.C. Girl, they sell pho. It's not even a lit spot, but it was lit last night. I've never been to their second floor, and that little area section or whatnot was tea. It was honestly just really good music. The DJ was, he was on, he or she was on point. The transitions was good, and if the music is good, and I'm around good people that I love, I'm going to have fun regardless, but a time was had. That really wraps up this weekend vlog because now I have to sit here and edit and gather my thoughts and myself. I'm about to order some food and prepare this video so it can get put out for you guys and get ready to go into the next work week. Okay, if you enjoyed this type of content, let me know.
<laughs> okay, I'm a lifestyle girly. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you want to see next, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, mamas. Mm -hmm.